These are the Shikos ruins. It looks like there aren't any Imperial Knights around. These footprints are still fresh. There's a lot of them, too. Which means it's either the Knights, the Thieves, or both. Some of these footprints must be Flynn's. Could be. Hey, over here, hurry up. I see. So first you get us alone in the dark, then you zap us, huh? Hmm. Zap. I like the way that sounds. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? Why are you smiling like that? Let's try to get along now, okay? Looks like no one's here. No Imperial Knights, Thieves, or anyone else. Maybe they're further in? How far in are we talking here? It doesn't look like anyone's been here, does it? The information about the Underground couldn't have gotten out, could it? The Underground? Recently, an entrance to an Underground area was uncovered here. A handful of mages are supposed to be the only people who know about it. But it's okay for us to know this? I don't have much choice if I'm to clear my name, do I? Clear your name, huh? The ground is scratched here. It's not like I would have minded letting the thieves have the ruins above ground after we finished the excavation. But it's a good thing we came here when we did. Well then, we'd better hurry up and follow them. All we have to do is move this? You have to put your shoulder into it. Um, it, right. Huh? Come on, just a little more. Carol, are you okay? Sure, yeah, that was a cinch. <sighs> okay, here we go. This is my first time going inside ruins. Be careful over there, it's slippery. What are you looking at? I was just surprised. You're actually a nice person. Oh, I knew it would be a pain to bring you along. I should have just come by myself. Do you always come to research these ruins alone? Yeah. Aren't you afraid you'll get hurt by monsters or traps? There are always risks if you're trying to actually do something. If someone gets hurt, it's an acceptable loss. Even if you're the one who gets hurt? Yeah. Don't you ever worry or hesitate? Worrying about getting what you want without anyone getting hurt? You've had a pretty easy life. An easy life? And Blastia will never betray me, so they're easy to deal with. Rita's amazing! She just comes right out and says what she has to say! She knows exactly what's important to her. I wish I knew what was important to me. Just travel around for a while. You'll figure it out. These ruins feel very different once you're inside them. Yeah, it's weird. And there's all this stuff I've never seen before. What, is this your first time too, Carol? Well, yeah. My specialty's monster hunting. Hey, what do you think this is? You really shouldn't be fooling around over there. This place is loaded with traps. Did anyone else just hear a click? Carol, watch out! Ah! Sorry, I thought you were about to get killed. I overdid it. I think I would have been better off getting caught in the trap.
was easy. These are the threads that we run through. Looks like this little one is no good. Wow. So this is what Blastia look like before they're excavated. I wonder why ancient people buried Blastia in ruins like this in the first place. I wish I could tell you. That's something else being researched. With all these Blastia here, I don't suppose there are any Aqua Blastia lying around too. None of them have cores in them. Really? Then they don't work, do they? Blastia aren't excavated with the cores and the bodies together. Cores produce magic through formulas. Bodies control that magic. The two combined are referred to as Blastia. Each Blastia possesses different attributes and is marked by a crest that indicates those attributes. With current technology, Blastia bodies can be manufactured, but the production of Blastia cores is impossible. So basically, cores are very valuable since they have to be excavated. It's only natural that thieves would want to steal them. That's not quite true. It seems Estelisa's information is a little outdated. What's outdated about it? There's some degradation of quality, but there's been some success in the synthesis of simple Blastia cores. Really? That's why I wouldn't do anything stupid, like go stealing people's cores. If I had time to waste doing things like that, I'd rather be spending it researching better ways to completely restore incomplete or degraded cores. That's what being a mage is all about. A noble creed, but that doesn't clear your name. Yes, talk is cheap, I suppose. Perhaps there are still some Blastia left that can be used. This one's still got a core in it! Here, try shooting this at the core. This ring set with something that looks just like a Blastia core. Glyph crystallization of a formula allows this Blastia to emit air as needed. That's not quite the best way to put it. It's actually used to charge other Blastia with air. But wait, how did you know that? In the castle, I read that the ring acts as a kind of key in ancient ruins. Castle? So all I do is point? Just aim the sorcerer's ring at the core of that Blastia. Face your target and shoot. There's a limit to its range, though. Go on, try it. That's all it takes. That's a Strim Crest. It's a mark that indicates movement. Huh. Interesting. for taking care of unwanted guests. Okay then, keep your eyes open and let's keep moving. Are you sure? What if I'm just luring you deeper into the ruins so I can zap you? I'm starting to think I'd rather try my luck with the golem. Here, you take it. Isn't this thing important or something? We'll need to use it a few more times. Okay, I guess I'd better hold it since I'm leading the way. I wonder if people a long time ago used little rings like this to move things around. Yes, items like this have been discovered in other ruins as well. It sure is useful for something so small. Yeah, unlike some people I could name. Huh? It's impressive that you've been entrusted with a sorcerer's ring, Rita. I've heard they're only given to a very small number of people. Huh, <laughs> I 
Guess someone trusts you. You're the only one who doesn't. Looks like they've messed up our order. Let's take them down. Hey! Attacking from behind is no fair! This one's strong! Don't just stand there whining! Alright. with an ambush? Monsters don't think. That was scary. I didn't expect to be ambushed from behind like that. Well, I guess we just can't ever let our guard down where there are monsters about. If they attack from the rear, any of us could get pulled into battle. Right. Let's be careful and hope that doesn't happen again. Hmm. This only happens with a preemptive attack. Preemptive attacks, huh? What? You guys! It's back! Hit it with what I gave you just now! Huh? You mean with this? Do it now! coming from a thief. I am not! I get it now, so that's how it works. I didn't know it could be used like that too. Right, let's get a move on. not too long ago oh yes well you see yeah I was in the castle a while back I used to be a knight you a knight please how gullible do you think I am believe it or not it's true will wonders never cease is it really so hard for everyone to believe that come on let's go hey they changed the subject on me Before you can beat me. Because you've lived a lot longer, right? Not exactly. I feel power. Oh, 
Repeat's getting really good at handling items, don't you think? Yeah, but I don't want to eat any gels that have been in a dog's mouth. He said, come on, don't be like that. If things go bad, take it. That's one big mouth he's... Wait a minute. Did he really say that? All I heard him do was bark. Stick around long enough and you'll figure him out. Right, Repeat? You look a little jealous, Rita. No way. Doesn't look so nice. We must be cautious. All right. The din of this modest land. Stop it! Out of my way! Fireball! It'll be a hundred years before you can beat me. Rita, you seem very used to fighting for someone who's been doing research in Ospio for so long. I'm just used to using magic, and I've been working to cultivate a calm mind. A calm mind, huh? Is there something wrong with that? Ooh, ouch! Sorry, I thought you were a monster. Uh, I'll startle you someday. You just wait. We can do this.
than personal. Too many. One at a time. One at a time. Hey! Jeez, what is this thing? So this is a Blastia too? But what I want is the Aqua Blastia, not this... this puppet. What are you doing? Don't just go poking at him like that! If I can just analyze him, I'll finally be able to complete my Anima formula. Huh? No, his Blastia core is missing! Rita, looks like one of your friends is here. Hey, who are you? M me? I'm just a Blastia researcher from Ospio. That sounded convincing. And just who are all of you? This place is off limits, you know. I think you just gave yourself away. I don't know who you are, but you're definitely not from Ospio if you don't recognize me. Guess she's got no problems with modesty. Yeah, this job is just full of problems. If it's not the knights, it's a bunch of kids. Ah, it's moving! Rita! Let me see. Wait a minute. What? How did you... I was just trying to heal your wounds. Hey, you guys! Stop playing around and help us! Ugh. All right, all right. I'm going after that idiot. You all take care of this. What do you mean you'll leave it to us? How are you gonna get through? Oh, that idiot! I guess we've got no choice but to play with this wind-up toy for now. Let's get this over with and go after that jerk! Be careful! He doesn't know how to go easy on people! Can we really defeat something this big? Please, calm down! I don't think this thing's gonna listen. Blastia have hearts too! The sword works better on a crazy
crazy things like this. Oh, fine. We gotta teach him a lesson. for evil. Let's go chase him down. Let's proceed quietly. I feel power. Oh, 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 I feel... All that's left is to cut off its power supply. I'm sorry. Rita, hurry! All right, all right! Come on, let's go! But Flynn... There can't be many knights here if our shady friend in the cloak is just wandering around. So you think Flynn is... I don't think he's here anymore. Come on! If I just had a little more time, I could have figured out the Anima formula. Is that why we were fighting that thing? Of course. You suck! You were already here looking for the thief. I just had you guys help out a little. Let's go, let's go. Hmm. If that ceiling collapsed, we'd be buried alive. What are you saying stuff like that for, Estelle? What if that really happened? Come on, don't be such a wimp. These ruins are made of stronger stuff than that. Estelle, now the ceiling's gonna collapse because you were talking about it! Huh? No, oh, sorry, I just stubbed my toe on a rock. You did that on purpose, didn't you? Yuri, you're mean. Come on! Let's hurry and finish up what we're doing so we can get out of these ruins!
guess we can do this. Yeah. Oh, Blades burn! You want revenge? Bring it! How can he just steal the core and walk off like that? Ah, stop! Make him stop! I've only been hired to do a job. I was told to get a good price for any blast of cores I could find. You stole cores from the Imperial Capital, too, didn't you? The Capital? No way, not me! Then maybe it was one of your friends. Y yeah, it's that Crete Dedeki. Where'd he run off to? He's probably picking up his money from the client right now. Client, huh? And who exactly might that be? All I know is he's somewhere in Torum Harbor. I, I don't know any more than that. He was a huge bruiser of a guy with a scar on his right cheek and one eye missing. So is this the guy collecting all the cores? And where did you steal that sorcerer's ring? Who, who says I stole it? The client gave it to me, said it would be useful for this job. Liar. That's not something the boss of some pickpockets could get his hands on. Uh, honest, you gotta believe me. This thing sounds pretty big. You think somebody important is behind it all? I think you're on the right track, Captain Carroll. This doesn't sound like some ordinary band of thieves. Man, first the knights, then the monsters, now this. Knight? Then Flynn was here after all. Yeah, that's him. That damn knight. Shut up! Great, Rita. You knocked him out. Now what? I'll have the city guards come pick him up later. All right, then. Let's get back to Ospio. So Flynn wasn't in there either. So, who is this knight exactly? He's Yuri's friend. Hmm, your friend? That must be a pain. Huh? Never mind. So what brings him to this town? He was looking for a mage to repair Halur's barrier blastia. Oh, that rookie. He came to see me too. Flynn did? Was he all right? Yeah, I guess. You guess? Well, since he's a knight, I'm sure he got some mage or another to help. Maybe he's already back in Halur. Oh, no. Well, do you trust me yet? I don't think Reed is the sort of person to steal. Vouch for her character all you like, but that doesn't prove her innocence. But... Don't bother trying to make him believe me. But I really didn't do it, you know. <laughs> well, I guess research seems to fit you better than robbery. Robbery. 
Yuri isn't very good at expressing his feelings. What a weirdo. I'm gonna go let the city guards know about what happened. Go and wait for me in my lab. I don't think those stubborn guards will let us pass through the entrance. True. Then take this with you. Show this to the guard and they should let you through. Thanks. Got it? Don't leave town without my permission, or you'll be sorry. It's a good thing the core thief you're chasing turned out not to be Rita, right, Yuri? <laughs> How do you figure that? I couldn't care less who the core thief was. I would have loved it if it were Rita. <laughs> I'd be done by now. I wouldn't let her hear you say that. Well, at least we got a lead for catching the real criminal. I can't complain about that. If you're that worried about Flynn, would you rather leave now? It's just... I've got to say a proper goodbye to Rita. Then take it easy. What are you gonna do after this, Yuri? I guess I'll go pay a visit to the guy behind all this core stealing. It sounds like Dedeki ended up going to the same place, too. In that case, we should make a beeline for Nor Harbor! Didn't he say Torum Harbor? Oh, right. You don't know. Don't know what? Nor and Torum are both ports of a city that extend across two different continents. On the Elikian side, where we are now, is the port of Kapua Nor. People call it Nor Harbor. Kapua Torum is the port on the other side, on the Tolbikian continent. It's usually just called Torum Harbor. So first we'll go to Nor Harbor. We'll have to pass by Emmied Hill on the way, but it's not that far west from here. I'll be going back to Halor. I still need to follow Flynn. Hmm, I don't know. Maybe I'll head back to Halur, too. Huh? Why? How can you just say that? The thief's gonna get away! There's no reason to panic. According to our friend in the ruins, it sounds like his client's base there. Besides, if we're going west, that'll take us close to Halur. Oh, man! But I... You gotta be somewhere? A sick girlfriend with an incurable disease or something? Man, if only she really was a frail girl like that. <laughs> I know I asked you to wait for me, but you sure made yourselves at home, didn't you? Oh, welcome back. What ended up happening to the thief? He's probably crying quietly to himself in his cell by now. Sorry for suspecting you. <laughs> what a heartfelt apology. I'll take it, though. It worked out pretty well for me, too. Rita? Well, thanks for the hospitality. What? Going so soon? We don't want to overstay our welcome. Plus, we're in a bit of a hurry. I'm so happy to have met you, Rita. I'm afraid we have to go now. I'll thank you properly later. Okay. So, tell me about this frail girlfriend of yours, Carol. What? The reason you want to go to Nor Harper is so you can see her, isn't it? H how do you know about her? I knew it! No! I mean, she's not even in Nor Harbor! Oh, it's not Nor Harbor? I, I don't know what you're talking about! You might as well come clean, Carol. It's obvious Estelle's not gonna give up. You've got it all wrong! Carol! If you're seeing us off, we'll say goodbye here. I'm going with you. You're doing what? Oh, so this is why you told us not to leave without saying goodbye, huh? Yeah. Is that it? Just yeah? Can you just leave like that? You're an important mage here, right? Hmm. I want to see Halur's barrier Blastia for myself. It's no good to the people if it's broken, right? Actually, the three of us fixed it together! Huh? What do you mean you fixed it? You're just amateurs. You know, we revived it! It was great! Let's just say Estelle... it was beginner's luck. Now I'm really worried. I'll have to go see if it's been done properly or not. Suit yourself. What? 
I've never had a real friend my own age before. I'm not so sure we're... This is gonna be so much fun. Yeah. When we left the capital, it was just me repeating Estelle. Now Carol and Rita have joined us. I'm so happy to have more people to travel with. I'm not so sure about some people in our party, though. I'm not so sure about you, you little runt. Hey, now. Go easy on the young captain. Rita, we all have to work to get along, okay? Oh, yeah. Right. We can do this. Odin of this modest land. Powerhammer. Odin of this modest The tree's already blooming? <laughs> I told you, we brought the tree back to life! Oh, you've returned, just as the knight said! Um, do you mean Flynn? Unfortunately, you just missed him. No way! Not again! He was quite surprised that the barrier had been fixed. Um, would you happen to know which way he went? N no, I I'm sorry. I, I don't know. However, he did entrust me with a letter. Wh what? A wanted poster? Wh why? I guess I made a little too much mischief. What kind of mischief gets you into this? It's my fault. Oh, come on. Only 5,000 gold? That's way too high for just breaking out of jail. You must have done something else. So, what does the letter say? I'm going to Nor Harbor. Catch up with me. Catch up with me, huh? Easy for him to say. He also writes that we should watch out for assassins. Well, he even knows we're being hunted. Sounds like this guy knows what he's doing. Looks like we have some dangerous people after us now. Well... I'm going to go to Nor Harbor. I could pass on a message for you if you want. But... Think about what you want to do. I'm gonna go make sure Rita isn't causing too much trouble. believe it i've never seen anything like this the flowers are in full bloom even though it's not the season for it and the barrier's strong too did estelise really do this what do you mean carol let it slip when we were leaving ospio you tried to change the subject but it was too late guess i blew that one we may just have nothing even remotely like she has so you just decided to come with us to eliminate the competition don't be ridiculous! I have a formula that I have to work out! 
A formula? What do you mean? It's nothing. Forget about it. So what did you want? You came here for something, right? Well, that just took care of about half of it. So, what's the other half? You said that it's easy working with Blastia because they never betray you. Yes. You and Estelle are both human. You're not Blastia. Oh, I get it. You're worried for her. Worried I might hurt her. Estelle's honest. Good. Unlike you or me. I'm just saying, don't do anything reckless. Come on, let's go back. Carol and Estelle are waiting for us. I finally found the clue I was looking for. I want to be all kinds of reckless. Wow, I've never seen this many flowers on Halur's tree before. Huh? Doesn't it always get like that when the flowers are in season? In season or out, I've never seen all the buds blooming at once like this. Really? Guess we're lucky to get to see something so amazing. I'd say it's more abnormal than amazing. while you can I say we've come to courteously escort you back to the capital and then we can clamp Yuri in chains where he belongs I've been waiting for you Yuri lol don't you move a muscle jeez this guy never lets up does he an old acquaintance you may be but today I could overlook your transgressions no longer Yuri isn't a bad person I asked him to go with me. Yeah, Yuri, you ruffian! You're coercing Lady Astelis! No, this is what I really want. I'll go back to the castle. Just leave me be for a little longer. I cannot allow that. Return to the castle with us. I can't go back. Please understand this. We have no choice. We'll have to apprehend the criminal as well. Ultimate fighting art! The Overlimit! The Overlimit doesn't belong to the Knights. Anyone can do it last time I checked. I say be quiet! An Overlimit? It's a technique to increase your abilities while fighting. How do you do it again? You fool! How could you forget something like that? I say I shall jog your memory, but after that, I say I shall give you a non-stop ticket on the train of death! First, attack! Curse you! Yeah! All right, you attack the enemy, and that raises your battle spirit. Blast! Your hits are not connecting at all! Yeah. Ouch! I say that hurt! Oh yeah, your battle spirit goes up if you're attacked, too. All right, and then, if you release the battle spirit that you've stored up, Got you just where I... Nice work, man. I'm sorry. I can't go back. I feel powerful. Yeah! Yeah. 
<sighs> what a shame. Uh, Rita! She says she's not going back, so get lost. Yuri, it's them again. Damn it. I knew they were still after us. What is it this time? W what do you mean? I'll explain later. Carol, which way is Nor Harbor? Uh, uh, it's west. West! You go over a meat hill, and Kapua Nor is right there. All right, let's go now then. But I can't. Ah, uh, make a decision. Which do you really want to do? Keep traveling with us or go home? I'm going to keep traveling. A wise choice, and one that those knights surely wouldn't be able to agree with. Imperial Knight Point One. With this sword, I shall protect the people, wasn't it? Indeed! Come on, boys! Let's show them what the Imperial Knights are made of! I'm sorry. Isn't it hard to use a weapon that large, Carol? It's a little heavy, but I need to hold something large like this to make myself look bigger. That's just the right trick to hide your minuscule size. Ah, you want to look bigger to fool the enemies. Now that you mention it, small monsters often puff themselves up to appear more menacing. Right, it's just like... Huh? Are you saying I'm the same as a monster? Even so, changing your appearance doesn't change who you really are, Carol. Are you dangerous? Tell us right now if you are. It's okay. I'm an elite hunting blade. There's nothing to worry about. I hope that's not another one of your clever tricks. So this is Emmett Hill? Yeah, but... That's weird. The barrier's gone. Do you mean there was a barrier here? There was when I came before. Sort of a waste to have a barrier in a place with no people, if you ask me. Are you sure you aren't mistaken? I'm pretty familiar with the barrier locations, but here... You just haven't heard about this one. Nan told me it was only put here recently. Who is Nan, Carol? Huh? Uh, she's... Uh, you know, she's just a friend from my guild. I I'm gonna go see if I can find anything out. I think I'll have a look myself. Alright, never mind us, guys. I'm not gonna go look for them if they get lost. Shall we, Yuri? Hey, no outsiders allowed! Let me through! I'm Rita Mordio of the Imperial Blastia Research Laboratory. Oh, you're a mage from Ospio. Excuse me. Oh, but you can't just do as you please. Let me go and ask the... <laughs> I could use some of her attitude. I think you have plenty already. Hey, listen to this! It was like, BAM! A spear went thunk, the Blastio went bang, and he flew off into the sky like whoosh! Who did what? How? Huh? Someone riding a flying dragon threw a giant spear at the Blastia, and then just flew off! A human riding a dragon? No way. I've never heard of anything like that before. That's what I thought too, but a bunch of people here saw it happen. They say it was a dragon rider. A dragon rider? <laughs> well, the world's just full of surprises. Hey! What do you think you're doing? Let me go! There she goes again. Something is definitely strange with this Blastia formula. There's nothing strange at all. Perhaps you are... Just who do you think I am? I'm well aware of who you are. The famed genius mage, correct? But surely there are some formulas that even you aren't familiar with. You can't use a weird formula like this. Think of the poor Blastia. Hey, stop gawking and help us catch her. 
Fire! Hey! Fire! What's with that kid? A fire? I don't hear anything or smell anything. Hey, you little liar! Crap! They caught on that fast? Hey! You were with that kid! Wait a minute! You! There's a warrant for your... It's now or never. Ugh, you little... Hey, wait! I'm sorry. Hey, stop gooping off and help catch that kid. Damn! Whew, looks like we lost him. You should really think more before you act. <sighs> that barrier blessed you was just so strange. I couldn't help myself. Strange? Something fishy about it? I have a feeling that may be an understatement. <laughs> well, our hands are already full as it is. So could you please keep us out of it? It doesn't concern you regardless. Yuri Lowell! Where have you run off to now? Hey, Mr. Famous. Sounds like you've got a fan out there. Again? Well, that gives a new meaning to the word workaholic. Lady Esteles? I say, do come out of hiding. You guys have a lot of problems. Just who are you, anyway? Um, well, I'm... Yuri! Come out! Come out wherever you are! You can talk about that later. like that anyway let's get our butts to nor harbor before things get any more complicated which way were we supposed to go again let's see as the crow flies isn't this a beast trail <laughs> can we really go through here we'll go as far as we can at least i don't want to get captured again we'll need to be on the lookout for monsters then eh what are one or two monsters to the brave captain carol yeah, that's right. Though, if the barrier were up, we wouldn't have to worry about monsters at all. Oh, I can't stand it. Why does some idiot have to go around breaking Blasty and making our lives difficult? Hey, Estelle. I noticed you keep looking in my direction. What's up? You don't mind if I ask? All right. Well, then, here goes. This man. Are you in love with her? <coughs> man is a girl's name, right? Is she the girl you wanted to show Halur's flowers to? Ah, no, 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 you got it all wrong. I do? Man, she'd be so angry if she heard you say that. Carol, good luck with her. I'm rooting for you. Uh, yeah. Well, thanks. That's encouraging. Fireball! Fireball! Holy power, come to me! 
It'll be a hundred years before you can... Hmm. I didn't know flowers like this grew in the mountains. Rita, don't touch it. Inhaling billy bolly leaf pollen can lead to vertigo and strong feelings of exhaustion. Hmm. Hey, what are you... Whoops, sorry. Carol, are you okay? You're interested in healing arts? Nah. It's no use. Healing arts don't work on this. We'll just have to wait until he recovers naturally. How long will that take? Carol, be strong. Ugh, Rita, you're terrible. I said I was sorry. If you're all right, then let's go. Let's be careful to stay away from the Billy Bolly Lee from now on, okay? Man, some people have some weird hobbies. I mean, who goes around destroying Blastia? I wouldn't really call that a hobby. If we ever come across whoever's doing this, I'll destroy him! But what if he has some reason for what he's doing? They can have any reason they want. Destroying Blastia is unforgivable, period. Oh, my, my neck! My neck! Oh! No! Help me, Yuri! Eh, that'd take effort. Just play nice with each other, kids. Estelle! Um, do your best, Carol. This one's strong. Get ready for anything. Holy power from Jim in this hottest wrath. Holy power, come to me. Green blades, first aid. Fireball! I gotta try and keep up. As you're ready. Power hammer. The cry of victory. Red eyes, nights. Why can't we just have a nice, fun, relaxing trip? You're one to complain, Yuri. Yeah, weren't those knights calling your name? But you're the one who was fighting with the mages, Rita. Please, everyone, we're okay, aren't we? I actually think it's kind of fun. If you think being chased is fun, you're gonna love the rest of this trip. Yeah, you may have written off what just happened, but we're still fugitives. Get ready for anything. Strength to of this modest Whoa! 
You want revenge? Bring... It was a pretty big commotion over breaking a single barrier, Blastia. I don't know. It seemed like the commotion Rita caused was even bigger. Stop bringing up trivial details! Of course people would be upset. It was a barrier, Blastia. Blastia are intertwined with almost every aspect of people's daily lives. Good point. Things got really crazy back in the lower quarter when the Aqua Blastia broke. I hope they can fix it soon. Yeah, I mean, that's what we're going through all this for. Survivor, huh? If we leave it here, it'll surely go back and try to attack Halur again. But Halur has the barrier protecting it now. Even so, how are the people of Halur supposed to sleep at night with beasts like this crawling around just outside the barrier?
Easy. Now Halor is safe as well. I don't know. I feel powerful. Oh, I... What the heck? It, it hardly put up a fight. But there could be a dozen more just around the corner. N no worries. Seriously. Well, let's just hope there aren't too many more where it came from. Starting to get tired. Maybe I should use healing arms. First aid! This is dangerous. Take that! Resound to cry a victory! Or, or, or. 
beautiful. This is... Look, Yuri. It's the ocean. I can see that. The wind feels great. I've seen pictures in books before, but I've never seen it up close like this. Well, people don't usually travel outside the barriers. If we keep going, we can see all sorts of things, like the jungle or the city of waterfalls. There are so many more things we could learn, if only our journey would continue. I guess it's true. I really was living in a small world. That's a rare moment of sincerity coming from you. It's your first time seeing it too, right? Well, yes, but... Aww. You must have had such a lonely life, tied to your research like that. Having you pity me makes me want to jump off this cliff. This water has traversed the world's oceans and has seen all there is to see. The ocean binds the lands of our world together. Here she goes again. It's really just one big puddle, you know. Whatever. You were pretty moved back there too. Huh? <laughs> so this is the world as he sees it. Yuri? Flynn must have stood on this spot earlier. And looked out at the same scene. That's true. His duties do take him to many different places. Always telling me to catch up with him. Easy for him to say. Nor Harbor is just around the corner from Emmett Hill. We'll catch up to him in no time. <laughs> That's not what I was talking about. Huh? What do you mean? All right, let's get moving before LeBlanc and friends show up again. Just follow the ocean road to the west after leaving here to get to Nor Harbor. We can't miss it. We'll have plenty more chances to see the ocean. Your journey will continue for as long as you want. <sighs> it's all up to you. You've made it this far, haven't you? That's true. Last one down's a rotten egg! You're gonna fall if you don't watch out. Oh! Idiot. to go to an inn. Oh, that's nice. Now you can go off and play Nature Boy whenever we sleep at an inn. And we'll sleep funny, too. W what are you talking about? Camping sets are single-use only. Rita, don't be so mean. Hmm. That sounds really useful, Carol. Yeah, they're essential when you're on the road. In addition to camping sets, you could also sleep on mats. But camping sets are really the best thing to use. You can't get a better night's sleep with anything else. What wonderful timing. All of you look so exhausted from climbing. You look pretty pooped yourself. Yeah, we've got a ways to go before we get to town, too. Maybe we should set up camp here. All right, I'll get everything set up. Oh, once you camp somewhere, you won't be able to camp around there for a while afterwards. Why's that? After camping at a certain site, the basic barrier that's included in the camping set will stop being effective for a while, so long as you're near that site. Basic barrier? What's that? There's no Blastia like that. It's not a Blastia, actually. It's just something that gives off a smell that monsters find unpleasant. That's why they call it a barrier. It can keep the monsters at bay for a night, but after enough time passes, the monsters get used to the smell, and it won't keep you safe anymore. Hmm, that makes sense. Well then, we'll leave the setup to you, Carol. All right, let's set up a camp a little bit further.